Let's bring in National Border Patrol Council Vice President. He's Art Del Cueto. Art, the numbers are pretty staggering. The sixth straight monthly decline since May. I mean, in May, it hit 132,000 border arrests. Now it's a little over 42,600. Big decline. Definitely a, a huge decline. And I've said it many times before. Uh, at the beginning of the presidential uh, uh, term for President Trump, the numbers went down on his rhetoric alone. Now, he's simply tr saying that we're going to enforce the laws that are on the books. That's something that people aren't reporting on. They're, they're thinking that he's bringing up something new. He's just saying, hey, let's do what we should be doing and should have been doing for all these years. It's, it's actually very refreshing. One thing that is concerning, though, in the Tucson area, uh, the numbers have been going up. Uh, so, uh, not like it is, you know, nationwide. Obviously, nationwide, they're going down. But in the Tucson area, they've been going up, which is where, the area where they had just recently found a tunnel down in Nogales. Oh, that's interesting. We're going to stay on that story. I want to get to the policies that you just mentioned. Catch and release was stopped where asylum seekers came in and waited for their hearings inside the country, often years away. It, and also doing what countries in Europe and T Turkey, Greece and Canada do, you got to wait for your hearings in the first country you enter. The U.S. got slammed for doing that. Trump got slammed for that. But other countries, Europe does it. Let's be honest. President Trump got slammed for that because there's a, there, there's a definite agenda out there by a group of individuals that it doesn't matter whether the president's doing the right thing or not. They just want to criticize him and attack him. I've said it, and I'll keep saying it. These individuals need to realize if their love for America is as great as they think it is, or are they more concerned with their hatred and anger towards the president? Uh, the president has done nothing outside the law. Yeah. He pretty much has just enforced the immigration laws that are there, and that's the right thing to do. There's a lot of group think about this, certainly on the Democrat side. They don't ever cite what MIT found. 22 million Illegals are already inside this country. This country does take care of immigrants. It is pro-immigration. The problem is some criminal illegals, for example, attack immigrant communities. That's bad. ICE is now moving to slap massive penalties and fines on hundreds of illegal aliens who have defied judges' deportation orders. That's a law that's been on the books for decades. Do you think there's going to be blowback on that? There's always going to be blowback when we're doing the right thing. But, you know, you've hit every single point that a lot of other news media outlets don't want to hit. You've made the distinction between legal immigrant and illegal immigrant. There's a huge...